What's up everyone, for the Winitachi here, you know what it is, and we are getting into something that I was dreading for a while now, and that is the return of world quests, uh, due to the fact that we now have what they call incursions, or Battle for Azeroth incursions, uh, that you can call them PvP assaults, they're basically how Legion assaults work back in uh, World of Warcraft Legion. Um, basically in uh, the Broken Isles every so often in a specific zone uh, all the world quests in that zone will be replaced with like four to five Legion specific assault quests uh, you're killing demons and all that stuff and I'm not gonna get into the details on that we're gonna be focusing on this so um, how the incursions work or how the um, battle for Azeroth PvP assaults work are if you're Horde, you're, of course, you're getting assaulted by the Alliance. If you're Alliance, you're getting assaulted by the Horde. And in your faction-specific zones, you will get notified if there is a incursion going on. Uh, with the enemy's faction symbol being located within that given zone. So, as you can see, Zuldazar and Nazmir for the Horde currently empty right now. But Voldun, on the other hand, has an assault. It's an Alliance symbol. So Vodin is under attack by the Alliance, uh, there's a, currently a time left of 5 hours and 55 minutes, it'll tell you everything that you need to know, and then when you go deeper into the zone, you'll notice the world quests that are originally there, instead of how it used to be back in Legion Assault, so actually still active. Now I don't know if this is a bug or something, but I hope they don't change this because this is great. It gives people that really don't want to do these incursions for whatever reason, an opportunity to just go do the other ones if they need to get their, um, their... I can't even think about it right now, but the thing on the bottom right of your map, that 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 thing, that element of the goddamn game where you have to do your four quests, for, I can't think of it right now, your emissary quest, there we go. Um, but whatever reason, we have, just like it was in Legion, um, four to five uh, world quests that are specified for this assault. So, the Alliance attacking a little bit in between the Terrace of the Devoted and Shattered Harbor at this moment in time. We've got five different world quests, and I'm going to show you... Unlike I did in Legion, I showed you every single world quest in the game. I'm not going to be doing that this time around. I've not done a world quest video since Legion and I don't want to. Um, I will be, however, showing you how this little assault event actually goes down. And I'll be showing it to you from the Voldoon perspective. Again, on the Alliance, you got the same thing with Stormsong, Dressvar, and Tearguard Sound. But you'll see a horde symbol there basically showing you guys that there is a little... Uh, Assault coming on from the Horde enemy. However, I'm on Horde. We've got the Alliance as our enemies, and we're gonna go ahead and show you guys a little bit of a cinematic of me doing a couple of uh, world quests here and there, and uh, we'll see what's next. <laughs>
Alright everybody, so I completed all five of the world quests uh, that were stationed here in this area. As you can see, they're all removed now. Uh, just to give you guys a quick heads up, these world quests for the assaults actually do go towards your emissary. Um, so, I mean, you can knock two birds in one stone, you can get the assault out of the way, as well as your emissary. Uh, also, again, um, most of the rewards from these world quests that I saw were either conquest points or they were, um, uh, what you call, war resources. So they were war resources and conquest points. Thank you very much for the subs, by the way, guys. Um, so war resources and conquest points as well as gold were the main resources of, of rewards from these uh, world quests. And uh, we're not done here. Uh, we've completed the quest uh, to def uh, to complete four out of four world quests, which is the quest that you get once you adventure into the zone. We're now being given automatically the quest called Isolated Victory, so we got to ride Aviash to the target, and this is Aviash Gosh. here. And Again, thanks for subscribing, uh, Bladder Die Blad. <laughs> nice name. So I have no clue where we're going, if I'm going to be honest with you. Oh, well, never mind. I do have a clue. It's exactly the same as Legion Assault, except we're running a PvP Alliance ship. So it wants us to absolutely destroy the enemy. So just basically stop the ship um, from being able to move. Kill all enemies. Uh, stop their... Basically destroy their uh, the little helicopters, short fuse the bombs, go boom boom in the room, kill the seventh legion or the seventh. Yeah, I guess. Pick up more bombs because we're cool. Use them on the seventh legion. Basically, it does a little bit of a little bit of minor damage and uh, a nice nice stun. And that's pretty much it. So we're going to continue to do that. And I will catch you guys when we get to the Capitano. Alright. So uh, with all the uh, enemy forces on the uh, main portions of the ship slain. We've now made our way over to the captain himself. Let's go ahead and see what this guy's all about. It doesn't seem too difficult. Especially when you got other people helping you uh, get the kills going in. But the, uh, the enemy alliance, man. Gotta stay away from us. Because uh, we're going to be coming in hard. And then now we get a ride Aviash to safety. So back to Aviash we go. Uh, not too sure if that's just going to be it. Because I remember back in Legion Assaults. We had some action. With like a huge three man scenario. But this, this is all solo content. PvP wise. So with the ship taken down, everything removed, everything destroyed, uh, I guess we can now turn in this quest. Now with the Alliance pushed back and their ship destroyed as well as their forces in Voldoom destroyed and dismantled as well, we now go to the Voldenai Emissary to turn in this quest that we were given at the beginning of uh, zoning into Voldoom, Isolated Victory. Uh, we're going to be given Honor Bound Service Medals, which is a badge of merit for action taken on the battlefields of Kultura, Sandalar, and Active Warfronts. Uh, sought by Provisioner uh, Mukra uh, at the port of Zandalar for the Horde. And uh, of course, the Alliance get their own version of this medal as well. Um, again, you can get these medals for both the Alliance and Horde by doing the um, Warfronts, which there's two of them now, which I have videos out for. And also, of course, these uh, PvP assaults, as well as a couple of other things. And these medals are spent at a vendor that is located near where you queue up and do all of your Warfront action in your faction's major city. And we're also given for us the Honor Bound uh, Equipment Cache, which is an item level 370 piece of equipment for our class. So we turn that in, and that is pretty much it. And so. with that completed, I mean, PvP assaults aren't as long as the Legion assaults were because Legion assaults had step-by-step -step scenarios. 
the actions after action we basically had to do the world quest then we had like three phases of a quest line and then we had a scenario it, it took it took a really long time to do and uh, the rewards out of that just weren't great enough and this I feel was a little bit better um, a little bit a step in the right direction I should say um, it wasn't a drastically long experience we basically just did the world quest and basically pushed and striked at the enemy right away um, that was one of six horde assaults now that I have uh, completed that I just found that out so we've got five more of these videos to do and that one was titled isolated victory so catch you guys in another PvP assault or a incursion if you will I'm gonna be calling them PvP assaults because that just basically makes more sense to me but thank you very much for tuning in catch you guys in the next one and peace out